Myers of America are often people from Puerto Rico, Mexico, and Honduras that have walked across our borders, moved themselves toward the Midwest in order to look as if they were born here. The Liars of America are often running dump trucks. They are participating in the lowest levels of the community in terms of stocking our food shelves. And sometimes they've taken over someone's route by literally killing them off and abusing their way into a company. As if they got hired somewhere, some way, and they end up taking over the person's social security checks and homes. And the company may never know it. The liars of America are here to stay. The liars of America hack our phones, hack our computers, and ruin our lives. The liars of America are also in police forces and lying networks. At the present moment, my computer is being hacked by some bitch on wheels, and I can't say why or where they think they have the right to do this underneath the laws of America. There is no law enforcement law that allows a police officer to take our computers over when we've done nothing wrong at all. And I promise you that the Lord God above is going to start retaliating against you and your community. Let this be a prophetic word to you that if you think you've got gifts of God, try again. If you think you've got opportunities by Jesus, try again. If you think you have the right to attack a pagan, try again. You've lied to yourself about your rights before the Lord Most High, and he will start ravaging your family with COVID. In America, we have rights. And when you take away God's right to provide the wife the husband, the lover, the job, the opportunities that God has planned for someone, you've got a raging, angry God giving out and doling out pandemics and epidemics to clean house. The liars of America also have COVID, have flu. They still keep working at serving food to me and you.